Welcome to Graber Works. I found a dial indicator holder that I like better and decided to give it a go, since I messed up the first one and needed to reprint it. I like the ZTEC dial indicator holder, but Babrines looks so much easier to print and doesn't require glue assembly and removing of the dial indicator backplate to fit the holder. The file comes from Thingiverse and the designer is Babron. I encourage you to visit his page. This print consists of one piece. This is just my experience printing his files on a mostly stock Creality CR10 and the file printed great. I have added the time and materials information from Cura as well as the settings I used. This is a view of the finished printed part. No sanding or finishing was required. Very few flaws were noticeable on the part. I used 1.75mm PLA on blue printer's tape taped to the bed. The part has three holes to mount the indicator to. Here's another view of the printed part and the required screw and nut to hold the indicator to the holder. I have chosen to use the center hole because I want the indicator to stick out from the holder. Here's a view of the holder on the extruder without the dial indicator or the mounting screw. The fit was pretty nice right off the printer bed and just required a slight press to place on the extruder. Here's the view of the dial indicator mounted to the holder and the holder mounted to the extruder. As you can see from the side and top views, if you use one of the other holes to mount the dial indicator, it would move the indicator closer to the holder or closer or farther away from the bed. I'll have to try it out in each location and see which location works best for me. I'm pretty happy with this print. Here's the holder being printed.